This arithmetic reasoning practice test question for the ASVAB and PICAT says a boat takes two hours to travel 15 miles upriver against the current. If the rate of the boat is 12 miles per hour, what is the rate of the current? So you may have recognized that we have all the elements of the distance formula, that is distance equals rate times time. We have a time right here of two hours, a distance of 15 miles and a rate of 12 miles per hour. That said, we have to make a modification to this formula to include this other variable called current, which I'm gonna call C. And let's talk about how we're gonna make that modification. Distance is not gonna change. Uh, this current is gonna affect the rate at which the boat travels. In fact, it's gonna slow the rate of the boat down. So to represent that algebraically, we're gonna do rate minus current because that current is slowing down the rate of the boat times time. So there's our new modified formula that we're going to be solving for C. Again, the distance was 15 miles according to the problem. Its rate was 12 miles per hour. We don't know how fast the current is, so we'll leave that as C. And it took two hours. All right, so there are a few ways as to how you can proceed. The easiest way to simply is to simply divide both sides of the equation by two here. Uh, this becomes... Uh, 12 minus C on this side, 15 divided by two. You should be able to do that mentally. It's gonna be 7.5. Uh, if you can't do that mentally, do it off to the side, 15 divided by two. Uh, two goes into 15 seven times without going over. Uh, two times uh, seven is 14. Uh, 15 minus 14 is one. We have to add a decimal now and a zero placeholder. Drop that zero down. Two times five is 10. And we gotta bring that decimal up into our answer. 2 times 5 is 10 with no remainder. So that's how we got 7.5. Now to solve for C, the next thing we're going to do is subtract 12 from both sides of the equation. This crosses out, leaving you with negative C on this side. What is 7.5 minus 12? Well, that's the same thing as 12 minus 7.5, but we know our answer is going to be negative. Let's add our decimal there. We can't do uh, 0 minus 5, so we're going to borrow. This is going to become 1. This is going to become 10. 10 minus 5 is 5. Drop down our decimal. 1 minus 7, we can't do. We have to borrow. This becomes 0. This becomes 11. This is going to be 4. So this is negative 4.5 equals negative C. Again, the current is going to be a positive value. So to get rid of this negative in front of C, we're going to divide both sides of this equation by negative 1. In doing so, this crosses out, leaving you as positive C on this side. Again, a negative divided by a negative is a positive. These negatives cross out. 4.5 divided by 1 is just 4.5. So we can see that the uh, rate or speed of the current is B, 4.5 miles per hour.